Hello friends, I warmly welcome you to today's episode on your source of power on Tuesday morning word with Daniel Oppen. Today's section, I want to tell you why, you know, sometimes we fail. Although, I mean, we have faith that we are going to get to do well. Yes, the reason is simple. Because we fail to prepare, you know, adequately ahead of time. There was one time, one guy got the opportunity to do a postgraduate program in one, you know, university abroad. But because of ill preparation, what happened any time he was asked of something, he said, oh, I don't know, I don't know. Instead of being smart, and then of course, checking out those important things, that was what this guy kept on saying. As a result, he was rusticated from the institution because of poor performance. And one thing that is very clear that I want to tell you this morning regarding every endeavor, whatever you are doing, is that I have to prepare ahead of time. So today, the message is simple. Prepare ahead of time. If it is a job interview, if it is, I mean, any interview, okay, whether job, whether it is for higher learning that you are going for, what you have to do is to anticipate, okay, the possible questions that you are likely going to be asked. And then, of course, get your answers ready, okay? So that as soon as they ask you, then you tell them. If you are a student, okay, I mean, if you are preparing, I mean, to take an exam, then what will happen is I have to anticipate most of the relevant questions that you are likely going to be asked. So that, yes, it's not the exam board I will be thinking so much, yes, so that you can have most of the answers, you know, off head before you go and then, you know, sit down, okay, for that paper, okay? If you are a teacher or if you are whoever, yeah, if you are a pastor, whoever you preach, what will happen is that you have to get your message right, you have to prepare adequately, okay? That does what I'm going to tell the people, okay? So that the information will flow, you know, chronologically, okay, to the understanding of the people. You know, for instance, before I go to any class and teach, okay, whatever I want to teach, okay, it's in my head, okay? I have organized my topic that I know that if I'm moving from this topic, I have to come to this topic so that the understanding, okay, will become very, you know, simple for the students, okay? So what am I telling you this morning? Preparation is key. Sometimes you may fail because you don't prepare adequately. Okay, you, your faith, I mean, might tell you that I'm going to win, but if you fail to prepare adequately, you know, faith without works, okay, that is meaningless, okay, so you have to really be able to, you know, apply your faith, you know, credibly, labor under correct knowledge, okay, have the correct knowledge in place, and then of course, you work adequately towards that, okay, so please, this morning, what I'm trying to tell you, Okay, what I'm trying to admonish you is that even if it's a business, okay, before get a plan down, okay, that is what I'll be doing, okay, so that you don't fail at the end of the day, okay, if it's an interview, if it is an exam you are taking, if it is whatever, whatever life endeavor, okay, if it's a presentation you are going to give, yes, you should have your message, you know, well organized and then of course you convey them in a chronological manner so that yes, your audience who also understand the message you are trying to convey okay so please get to know that because one thing that you know you have to know okay i mean for instance most people who have been successful okay successful business people yes they've always planned they do business analysis they have to check the risk assessment the feasibility studies all of them have to be done and those, all those things involve effective planning that is the preparation ahead of time so please share this message to friends and family so that they can also get motivated this morning. And as you move out for the day, yes, I mean, carry this message with you. And of course, labor under correct knowledge with this. Now tonight, yes, I have a video on human anatomy for you once again. And this time around, we are going to look at, you know, the muscles, although they are underdeveloped, okay, they don't really function so much in human beings unlike in other primates like dogs and all that 
yes do his muscles which are going to work on yes tenor here yes the pinna okay to help either move it you know either superiorly you know anterior or posteriorly so we are going to look at the auricular muscles okay you know anterior posterior and of course superior auricular muscles as being part of you know some muscles you put them under facial expression muscles actually so please make a date with me and don't miss it out if you've not subscribed to my channel please do so so that yes in future videos you'll be able to enjoy those ones as well have a good morning may good lord be with you and may you have a nice day amen